when the Audi RS5 of the current generation debuted five years ago. It had some of the visceral performance that made it famous. The RS5 is not sluggish as a result. Contrarily, it is a competent performer, but as it changed from a V8 to a twin-turbo V6, it lost some of its thrills and theater. With a new competition package that improves handling and braking as well as a sport exhaust system to get your blood pumping, the 2023 Audi RS5 aims to reclaim some of that magic. What drives the RS5? The RS5 has high levels of road grip and can turn in an impressive 3.7 seconds from 0 to 60 miles per hour. It can also pull a full G around a skid pad. It lacks some of the excitement one would expect from an RS vehicle subjectively. It becomes a very dynamic performer in sport mode but it does so by using sophisticated differentials that give the impression of a neutral or even loose rear end. There is a significant delay before the engine spools up and the vehicle begins to move in normal driving modes. Find deals on a used RS5 near you. How about the interior? The interior of the Audi RS5 is much more user-friendly and less distracting than that of the previous generation. There are a lot of physical buttons here, so you won't have to look through touchscreen menus like you would with the more recent design. The placement of each control is thoughtful, and it has a feeling of quality and solidity. It's simple to get to the front seats, and once there, you feel like you're sitting a little bit taller than you would in a sporty sedan. To clear the sleek profile of the rear roofline, passengers in the back of the vehicle will likely need to stoop a little. There isn't a lot of headroom back there. Due to the limited toe space under the front seats, legroom is also limited. Except for a substantial roof pillar at the rear that blocks your over-the-shoulder view, visibility is good. How is technology? Like us, some people may prefer the RS5's previous generation infotainment system to the new one. The driver can easily see the display on the infotainment system. Additionally, Dial controllers are less distracting than touch screens for menu navigation. Bonus features like programmable shortcut buttons are nice. The smartphone integration systems for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are standard, and in our testing, they booted up quickly and without a glitch. Fuel economy How much fuel do you use? The RS5 Sportback, according to the EPA, gets 21 mpg combined, which is pretty good for a car this fast. On our highway heavy evaluation loop, we achieved 22.8 mpg. That's always a good sign because it suggests that the EPA's mileage estimates are accurate. Is the price of the RS5 fair? The build quality of Audi vehicles is consistently excellent, and the company is able to create a luxurious interior without going overboard. The interior of the RS5 is no exception. You'll realize just how much some nice things cost if you look at the window sticker. We believe that the BMW M5 and Mercedes AMG E63 are in the same price range and compete in different performance leagues, so our S tested cost reached $100,000. Although Audi's warranties are fairly standard, they do provide the initial scheduled service for free, 
which is more than some other brands provide. Which RS5 is suggested? The most important decision is whether to go with the 4-door Sportback or the Coupe because there is only one trim level. Models of the Audi RS5 The 2023 Audi RS5 is a high-performance car that sits above the A5 and S5, but its power and appearance make it stand alone. There is only one trim level available for either the RS5 Sportback or RS5 Coupe. 